Good morning. currently 25 to 5 in the morning hence I've got the lights on and honestly I haven't been asleep yet I don't feel tired but I know I'll feel tired later so I thought well I haven't filmed in a while Let's see where all the day goes. So I've come down. I've been really quiet because they're still in bed. So I've come down. I made myself a cup of tea that I never get to have. And yeah. I think it's going to be a long day. But my idea is I'm going to nap when Esme naps. I think we're just going to play all day. And yeah, just see how the day goes. Like, it's weird. I've just done a close, and that's why I'm up so early. I got, literally got out bang on 12 o'clock. I did a 5 to 12 shift. All fine. I got in at quarter past 12 because I'd driven. Like, I, I passed my test, yay! Um, so, I've driven myself home. And I had a shower because I was gross, me in. Um, got into bed, flicked through my phone a little bit, put my phone on charge, and I was like, no, this isn't happening. This is not happening. Um, anyway. My mind was just like flicking off with all the things I need to do today. You know, like I need to make sure I've got a wash, make sure I've got uniform for the Tuesday, but all day today off. Like it's weird, my eyes feel tired. Like I could just sit with them shut. But actually going to sleep doesn't work. I've been laid up there since maybe. 25 to 1 20 to 1 wow I was only quick in the shower do you know what I mean I was just having a quick wash um so yeah I've been sat in laid in bed since then till now you know 20 to 5 and I decided not I'm just gonna get up because I laid my eyes shut and like my brain then started to talk um I just couldn't shut it up, so I was like, right, okay. So, 
so yeah great start to the morning really um like i said i'm just gonna see how the day goes see how the day pans out and take you with me i suppose it's now nearly half past nine I feel a bit icky, to be honest. Just a little update, I feel icky. Sat on the sofa then um, while Esme had a drink and I could have fell asleep. Not falling asleep at, you know, half 12 last night when I got out of the shower from work, but at nine o'clock the next morning. <sighs> I mean, it's not ideal, is it? Like at all, so I mean, we need to. Go, I need to go to Tesco and get some bits and bobs. But honestly, it's finding the energy. I am one hundred percent having a nap when Esme does, but I'm gonna get dressed. I'm gonna get dressed, try and motivate myself, and you know attemptively wake myself up i don't know if that's actually gonna work or not but i'm gonna attemptively pardon me wake myself up i feel icky i don't feel very well glad i'm not at work today to be honest and yeah i'm just gonna take my time i think try and wake myself up but um yeah we shall see but i do Bad idea. I went upstairs at, I think it was about 10, no, I think it was about 9 o'clock the last time I came on. Um, yeah, I think it was about 9 o'clock when I last came on and I was walking upstairs saying, you know, I'm gonna get ready, get dressed. I got dressed. I didn't lie, I got dressed. Um, and yeah, I ended up laying down on, on the bed. I have to get dressed. My hair's all fluffy. <laughs> um, yeah, I ended up lying down on the bed mm -hmm. with Esme next to me, and she was on my phone, having a bit of screen time. And yeah, she kept getting up and going and playing with the toys. So I was, I was like in and out of sleep. And I didn't realize it was like nearly twelve o'clock by the time I looked at my phone. The next time. <clears throat> I was like, well, I really have no energy to go downstairs and make lunch first. So I was like, do you want to have a little nap? And I thought, you know, I'll be in and out of sleep. I'm not going to sleep, sleep. Um, and she went to sleep, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Went for a nap. And um, I fell asleep, like, well, pretty much almost straight away. Popped the camera on and she was asleep. That was at 20 to 12, right, no, 20 to 1, by the time we both went to sleep. Uh, that's exactly 20 to 2, no, 20 to 3, it's not 20 to 3 now. Um, I've just, we just woke up, well it's not 20 to 2 now, but at 20, uh, 20 to 3, we both woke up and I was like, oops. Um, Esme never has two hour, like, nap, she has half an hour and that's it. But I think because of how I'm feeling today, I just think I've got a plan. I've had to put my washer on a spin because I didn't realise that finished. I didn't, I couldn't even remember that I put it on to be honest. I obviously had more energy when I woke up this morning than I do, did at like 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, whatever it was. But yeah, as soon as 9 o'clock hit, it just seemed to be like, I need to go to sleep. Which is how I should have felt when I got in from work yesterday. Um, at, I think it was all four past twelve. I should have felt like that then. I should have had a shower and gone straight to sleep. I don't think the shower last night would have helped, but it had to. I had to. I had to because I would not have got to sleep. Uh, I would not have uh, got. Yeah, I still wouldn't have got to sleep, given the fact of how like warm and sweaty and disgusting I felt after work. So yeah, it, that will depend a lot on how Esme goes to sleep tonight. Um, she might end up just going to bed a bit later, which is fine. 
So that, that's all I've done. It's just yellow today. But yeah. I woke up and I had all good intentions of going to the shops. And that didn't happen. Um, and Dan took the car, so I couldn't even be driven. I don't know if I would have driven, to be honest, with how tired I actually feel. Um, but. Yeah, I don't know. I think today is a write off, that's for sure. Um, and it's probably a very boring video. Um, so I'm probably going to leave it here until tea time. It's currently. Ten to three. So yeah, Dan finishes work at six. So like I said, she's only just getting something to eat, bless her. Um, we're having. I'd actually like to show you what we're gonna have tonight for tea. Don't know who's making it. Could be me. Might not be me. But yeah, we're gonna have. Sorry, just flip the camera around. Roast potato, bacon, and crispy kale salad from HelloFresh. This isn't an ad, by the way. Um, these are the ones we've had so far and oh my god oh my god they're all beautiful so we had that that was yummy like really yummy um, got a bit overpowering after a while I think I had like too big of a portion amount of mine this was okay it was nice you know, don't get me wrong um this was probably Dan's favourite, but I thought it was quite strong in terms of um, the tomato puree and tomatoes that I put in it. Um, but otherwise it was okay, just got a bit rich towards the end. This is the one Dan made and he made it not yesterday because I was at work till midnight, the night before. Um, Saturday night and that was yum yum. So was that. So yeah, those are my two favourites. He probably liked the others, but... Yeah, tonight we're having roast potato bacon and crispy kale salad. Maybe. <laughs> like I said, it depends on like Dan when he gets get home. Um, obviously, it's a bit. It's a bit difficult when you wanna you wanna eat healthy, but on a day like today, it's just not really gonna happen, is it? You know what I mean? So there might just have to be a write-off and we'll have to say about uh, kale salad. But on a good note is I have all this stuff in my freezer from the the week after's box from HelloFresh. So you realise that I just signed up for a subscription as well as the free box from my friend. Um, so I literally have a drawer absolutely rammed um, full of the meat there's a bun in here okay you've got a square roll so yeah i need to move all of that out of here now into my freezer uh, <laughs> into my fridge because um we're probably gonna have those this week because tomorrow i finish at half two probably have to pick esme up the wednesday i finish at three Oh wait, no, that was that. that. That was this week. That was last week. Yeah, you put that there then. You eat the other one. Uh, sorry, tomorrow I finish at four. Wednesday I'm on another clothes. I better go to sleep that night. I swear. Um, Thursday I'm five till ten. No, ten fifteen. So yeah, um, Tuesday. <laughs> And probably Saturday and Sunday. Tuesday, Saturday, Sunday. So I'm gonna get ow, three meals out there. I think maybe I don't know. I might get Dan to do it to pick his to pick three meals that he wants. Um, and then once he's done that, once he's picked like three meals that he would like, I can get the the meat out or the like the tomatoes and things like that and mushrooms and they're all in there. Um, I feel terrible today. I feel like I'm just not on top of it. Like normally, like when I get a full night's sleep, well, it wouldn't have been a full night's sleep getting in at like midnight. 
at quarter past midnight and then going in the shower because I felt gross. But it would have still been like maybe eight hours sleep, nine hours sleep, which is what you need as an adult. Um, you need, I'm gonna put you in the wash basket in a minute. <laughs> Um, as an adult, you, you need at least eight hours sleep. So, you know, if I actually went to sleep, I wouldn't have seen her murmur and then decide, oh, I'll get her up. Um, and because of that, I... I went up and said, oh, you get me up in the morning. And, and she was stirring, but she probably would have gone to sleep if I was asleep. Um, because what she tends to do in the morning is she'll wake up and then she'll try and like just lay there for a bit and either go up to sleep or get up in like two hours. She'll just lay there so quietly. Um, I'm going to pop you on here. Yeah, I feel very not on the ball is what I would say. You know, like I'm used to just my dad's, my, oh God. But to his off, I'm just used to like. Getting everything done, like. You know, I'll get like the washing done, I'll get the. You know. Mama. Um. Mama. Yeah. Mama. I'm done. Yeah, sorry, my air is just like decided to break. But yeah, I'm like, I'm used to on my days off getting everything done. Um, and <laughs> today, that is not happening. It's not happening at all. Now I think if I had the car, I would have maybe... I would have maybe... Used that to my advantage today. Probably like got the shops in my car. But again, I didn't have my car to my advantage, so I just had to follow up with what I had, and that was lack of sleep. <laughs> I had so much lack of sleep. Um, on a good note though, um, looking back at my weight loss, on my weight loss journey, um, I, seem to, I seem to have been fluctuating between 9 stone 8 and 9 stone 10. I was either one or the other or in between, well, yeah, I was either one or the other, so I must have been a fluctuating, like a fluctuation in between. Um, last time I weighed myself was 9 stone 8. Um, and since then i've not snacked between meals obviously today all i've had is toast but i don't feel hungry right now so i'm okay for the time being um i might just nibble until dan gets in later um yeah i feel terrible at not going for a walk out to the shops it doesn't look the best outside today in my defense um so my car would have probably come in useful but because at nine o'clock this morning i was falling asleep on the sofa like i couldn't keep my eyes open probably wasn't a good idea so yeah um i'm going to put a wash put the washing on this area finally um luckily i've got uniform to, for tomorrow so if anything needs ironing i can do that tomorrow when i get in it whatever time three o'clock um might not even be that because i'll have to go and pick his me up i think
come on man. Let's see what we can do with all this. Should all be there. Let's just check it. Potato, yes. Red onion, yes. Carrots, yes. Clove of garlic, yes. Flour. Ground cumin. Honey. Baked almonds. Bacon laddons balsamic vinegar and kale and that's all let's see what we can do nearly ready i'm up to it's gone that step when the potatoes are done so it's nice to have all the steps there and it literally it comes with all you meat in packaging like this and you just put it in the fridge or if you don't want to use it yet freeze it and all your these the dry stuff um comes in these numbered bags and the number corresponding is on here really handy so i've done my carrots they're ready to go in in a minute the potatoes are cooking and then the potatoes are cooked um, put them in this that I have heating up with oil and then the carrots go in after half way through rolls and then I do the almonds bacon garlic vinegar and honey and then you just pop it all on your plate. Ta-da! It should look like that. I'm not doing the onion though because it looked a bit weird and I'm not a huge fan of onion. So we shall see.